hi guys good morning how you guys doing welcome back to my channel so if you're new here you're absolutely welcome my name is fumi so on this channel we have been posting a series of um daily videos so we're doing the do what you can challenge which means posting every day for 100 days um while we were doing that i ended up losing a very close family member so that really like knocked me off course in a serious way but we are gradually getting back to the we're gradually getting back to the groove of things and how things should be so um i'm back basically so i will be going to lagos today so I'm going to Lagos today. I want to go to my sister's birthday is tomorrow. So I'm going to spend a few days with her just to have a good time. Relax, you know, rest a little bit, have a good time, you know. So I'm going to be doing that and I'm going without my kids. <laughs> and I feel like I always enjoy this like alone time without my kids. Sometimes a little bit too much. It doesn't affect the fact that I love them and I spend almost all the time with them. But at least when I'm not with them, actually, I enjoy it. I enjoy it a lot. So that's what we're going to be doing today. So I'm just getting ready now. I want to quickly, I want to quickly get to the market because I want to make soup that I'm going to leave while I'm traveling. I'm not going to be spending a lot of time on this trip. It's just like three days. I'm going this morning. So my flight was supposed to be in the morning, but because of the weather, flight was postponed till the evening. So I'm going to market to make some soups and my flight is in the afternoon. So I'll get there afternoon slash evening-ish and spend today, tomorrow, and spend tomorrow, the day after, and then I'll be back. So I'm just spending about three days with her, but I can't wait. Like, I can't wait. I love Lagos. I miss Lagos. I miss going to Lagos all the time. So it's good to go see my Lagos side of the family. Just have like a swell time. So if there's any content you'd like me to do while I am in Lagos, please let me know. Comment section below and let's go. Bag, you get the small one. Maybe then, uh, province Alpha, I did market Alpha. Give me premier, give me premier, half dozen. No, baby, I'm me. Promise, I'm coming Alpha. Pay how much for money fresh? Eh? Of, uh, two show. I'll be waiting there the column. Even though we say, oh, the economy, the, you know, we're trying to be spiritual and we're trying to think positive. We're trying to say, oh, the matter of the economy is what we provide. When you come to the market, every time I come to the market, I always just get to get it. Because if I think about the fact that what I was buying last year for maybe a bag, like a bag of soap now that I usually buy in the house, I used to buy it for 3000 now it's like six five for one bag of soup. Do you understand? And I'm just like, wait All these things you guys are pressing me. Why can't I keep this country? I'm tired. Like, I'm tired of Nigeria. Oh my God. Like, it's so stressful. It's stressful for me, stressful for everybody. Like, everything goes up. It's like per second. You come today, it's two five. You go home and come back seven five you go home and come back it's like eight thousand just keeps going up and it's just like what are we gonna do lord please provide provide for us father lord 
that's all we can possibly ask for. But anyways, it's raining. I can't tell you that my flight's in the afternoon. It's raining, so I'm just trying to see what I can do. I'm trying to buy stuff that while I'm away, I don't want anything that my kids will be like, no, oh, this has finished, or that has finished, or they don't have that. So I'm just trying to stock up on a few things and then be done. How much for Mama Lemon? Mama Lemon, one one. Mm. Money fresh, how much? One two. Oh, hundred naira difference now. What's this? What's that? Um, potato. Hmm? <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. What can you do with yam? Potato. No beans. What food can you make with yam? <laughs> so anyways, essential things. Yam. I think yam is coming back in season right now because i'm seeing a lot of like big yams but i don't know if it's but i'm not seeing like paper there's no paper yam yet and paper yam is like my favorite yam then we bought a few bunch of plantains that are a little almost like almost ripe so when you put it in the fridge at least in like a week or two it will be completely ripe and you'll be able to eat it next thing i bought is she he next thing I bought is starch. So starch I made bought starch because I wanted to make whole soup. I will probably make it when I come back. I've not been able to make it and then I bought this palm oil. So this palm oil is native palm oil. It's not like the normal one. This is like the local ones that are made by those mamas and you use it to make soups. So it's not like the what they call that palm oil. If you leave it to settle You'd have like maybe very really tiny oil at the top and every other thing would be like the thick side of the palm oil. It's called local palm oil, the native palm oil. I don't know what it's called, but that's what I bought. Then I bought a few provision and stuff. Then I bought fish, dried fish. This is shine shine nose or shiny nose. So I bought it and then they broke it. I'll probably this ones I'll use to make soup over soup when I come back. Then I bought crayfish. So this is not your normal crayfish. This is the crayfish they use for over soup. It's very, very like tiny. Native salt and potash. So this is native salt salt. This is native salt and this potash. Open it from top so you wash it before you use it, but it's actually salt. So you just yeah. The local salt that is not processed, so it doesn't have... So it's not iodized, is what I mean. This is like salt in its purest form. So that's what you use to make a lot of native soups, pepper soups, those kind of... And this is potash. Uh, I don't know what they call it in like local languages. What they call potash where you are, but this is called potash. I don't know the local name, Sha. But if you know it, please let me know. Comment section. So about potash. Mommy, what is the about fish? I didn't buy about fish. So I bought lady fish. Then, so this is lady. I didn't buy about this time. Just shiny nose and lady. I mean, lady salt in the stove. So this is lady fish, is and those things are the things I'm going to be using to make my own soup when I come back. So I'm just going to tie them up and leave them outside. We are ready so far to travel. Guess it wasn't meant to be Like every time I'm traveling, I'm always running late to the airport. But anyways, I'm at the airport now. And
and everything. To see my sister, going to see my nieces and my nephews. I just have a fun, relaxing time for a few days. Um, I'm hoping that while I'm in Lagos, I'm going to be able to collaborate with a few creators, uh, see my friends, and just have like an all-around good time. But let's go, let's go and check in. Let's go and check in. I'll. But oh well, I will keep you guys posted. But for now, let's go and check into our flight. Let's not miss the flight that we're already here for. So let's go. I had to stop at my favorite spot called Toasties at the airport. Well, they have other branches in different parts of Lagos. It's just it's easier for me to just stop. You guys know I love it. I love toast. I try to always make it at home, but I feel like mine is never as good as Toasties in Lagos. So that's usually like my first stop once I'm getting in, and my last stop when I'm getting out. And this toast for today i ordered the asun toast with chicken toppings and it was divine like it was so delicious i was like oh my god this is just it fulfilled you know when you have like a craving and it fulfills a craving that's exactly what happened oh my god <laughs> This is a good day for me to start the rebuilding fight. The roads that they open on the knee, and the old ones gone on the night. And I can feel the wind up on my skin. You won't enter last week, you just didn't do the work. So I have arrived at my accommodation. If you guys remember this place from when I came from my training, 
Sen så är det kombat till. Nu kan vi komma. Åh, det är ju. Hej! Så. Jag har finalt. Så jag har finalt gått in i. My card was having issues. I had made payment. I had booked for the room, but I had not paid, so I tried to pay. But anyways, let me do a quick room tour before I go to sleep because I'm tired. Let me just show you guys' room. So it's just a simple room. I'm just thankful because they turned on the AC before I got here. So it's cool. TV, table, um, bed. Curtain, um, window, so it's almost like an Airbnb ish kind of vibe. Yeah, restroom. So, this is going to be home for tonight. I'm tired, I'm tired. I'm tired. No, good. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Well, something's got to give today. Is a good